when a giant rainforest mantis confronts a spiny leaf insect. It's a monster battle. It's one of the rainforest's most bizarre citizens. A creature so strange, it could be from another world. In the bug world, spiny leaf insects are giants, growing up to five inches long. They're not only big, they're ugly. Spiny leaf insect wants to avoid a fight. Its first defense is the fact that it looks like a leaf. If a predator does get past the camouflage and detect a spiny leaf insect, it'll then rely on its behavior to try to scare off a predator by making itself look big and mean and horrible, like some sort of alien predator from another planet. Nature often saves scariness for the vegetarians. You see, they need to deter their predators rather than fight them. Although it looks like some kind of battle bot, the creature isn't naturally aggressive. Its heavy armor and razor spikes are for defense, an almost impenetrable shield. And if a predator does try to take a bite, it'll get a mouthful of those spikes. The spiny leaf insect also keeps a secret weapon. If threatened, the spiny leaf insect will resort to chemical warfare. It has glands that'll squirt out this colorless but extremely stinky liquid that'll deter most predators. A stinking, ugly, spiky giant should be left alone. But in the rainforest, there's one creature who's not so easily deterred. It's an evolutionary success story. The giant rainforest mantis. A strong arm assassin and stealthy ninja rolled into one. Mantids need to eat all the time, so they're very hungry. They're looking for prey all the time. They're on duty all day long. Turns out that they're one of the top rainforest predators. It's the T-Rex of the bug world. With a powerful stance and lethal forearms, spikes and lightning-fast grappling hooks ensure nothing escapes. The strike can happen anywhere from 30 to 50 thousandths of a second. So this is like 1 20th of a blink of an eye. Mantids engage in aggressive mimicry. And what this means is they camouflage themselves so their prey doesn't see them. Matching in with the vegetation, in this case, our giant rainforest mantid, is a nice green. It blends in. Prey items that are walking by, they just don't see the mantid until it's simply too late. This hapless grasshopper never stood a chance. There's one more thing about the giant rainforest mantis. It eats its victims alive. They're pretty good at orienting their bites toward the head of whatever they've captured. And essentially, once you've taken the head off of anything, it stops struggling much more rapidly. The best defense against the mantis is to avoid it at all costs. But that's not always easy. This spiny leaf insect is out looking for a leafy meal. Unaware, it's venturing into giant rainforest mantis territory. The spiny leaf insect is a browser. It's a vegetarian. Think of it basically as the cow of the insect world. 
just spends most of the day hanging out in the tree, chewing on the leaves, minding its own business. The leaf insect has attracted the attention of the mantis. And when these two giants of the rainforest come face to face, neither backs down. The mantis is the natural aggressor. It's sizing up the monster before it. No predator wants to be injured by its prey. If it's going to attack, it needs to uh, make a trade-off, basically. If it attacks something, is it going to successfully kill it and not get injured itself? Next, two giants collide. Beneath the lush rainforest canopy, two giants of the bug world are about to go head to head. In order to avoid a fight, the spotting leaf insect will actually use its bizarre appearance to try to look like this threatening, horrible alien monster. No predator wants to be injured by its prey. So in this case, you've got a really big rainforest mantid, but at the same time, the spiny leaf insect is really quite a large insect. The giant rainforest mantis has weighed the options. It's only a matter of choosing the moment to strike. We won't win. But with faith in its heavy armor, the spiny leaf insect pushes gamely forward. The mantis's powerful jaws start slicing through its victim. The heavy armor is holding. The spiny leaf insect deploys its chemical weaponry. In a fight, a spiny leaf insect is going to rely on its armor to hold out long enough for it to get away. But it's not very fast. It will, however, keep spraying the chemicals, but unless a predator gets a perfect shot and gets deterred by that, it's only a matter of time until it's dinner. The spiny leaf insect has to break free soon before it's devoured. <laughs> Breaching the armor, the more the mantis eats, the less its victim can fight. It's a race through the first course. Mantis mouth parts work overtime as cutlery. Mandibles slice and dice, while feelers fork it in. Another life ends in the rainforest. What the mantis can't eat, others will. The giant mantis is happy to share now. It's full, and there's a mess to clean up.